young Nigerian entrepreneurs have been taxed to remain focused, resolute, and continue to believe in their dreams. This was as they converged in Abuja uh, for a first funding conference, which was organized by the Skillset Academy and the Honey-Based Group, with an aim at mentoring young business owners and providing funding for their businesses. Our correspondent, Amadine Uyi, reports. It was a session for young entrepreneurs, many of them with ideas but without funds to translate their ideas into viable businesses, with a large youth population, many of them unemployed. Business experts believe Nigeria can translate its unemployment bulge through entrepreneurship. Entrepreneurs are the heartbeat of the economy. Entrepreneurs are well empowered. The GDP of the nation will go up because we are the bedrock of the economy. The conference team, the funding conference, is expected to appraise several viable business ideas, mentor the entrepreneurs, and provide funding to support their businesses. The funding conference was motivated by the fact that we believe that irrespective of how beautiful your dreams are, irrespective of how inspiring your business ideas are, without funding to push that business from an idea to a reality, you will stay broke. So it means that irrespective of what the government is doing, irrespective of what people are doing, without having the right channels to fund people with credible ideas that can be duplicated, that can employ other people of the street, we will still move around circles of having empowerment programs, giving people startup packs, and at the end of the day, because they are frustrated without structure and mentorship, they go and sell the startup packs back. The idea of the project is to open the eyes of, you know, um, people out there, business owners, um, SME traders out there, to um, opportunities that are bound in accessing funds. Organizers of the conference say the idea is to support small businesses as a way to transform the nation. I trust that the solution is in you and I. It's for us to decide that we will not depend on what government can do for us. We can depend on changing the things around us that we can change. And how do we do that? We need to acquire the necessary skills that can attract the funding we need, that can also allow us to manage the funding we attract, to multiply the funding we attracted, to make it grow, employ others, and also contribute to building a better society. Because trust me, nation building is our collective responsibility. So many people, you know, have the ideas. They, I mean, they know what to do. But, I mean, when it comes to, um, I mean, they have business ideas, but they don't even know what to do to bring these business ideas to action. Several pitches and business ideas were entertained. However, only one winner emerged. An ecstatic and young Chisom Marvelous could not contain her joy. When I started hearing people's business ideas, I was scared, I will not lie. But somehow, I had to just encourage myself, okay, if you've gotten this far, then maybe you can just, you know, make it down. Oh, I'm God, I am so... I don't even know how I feel right now. <laughs> Many people said this program, we came here because of you, and Lord knows I am... Oh, I, am I don't have words to express how I feel, honestly. I am beyond excited. <laughs> She gives a word to other young aspiring Nigerians. Don't stop. It's what you're doing now, as long as it is good, do not quit. Be consistent. It will pay off. That's all I have to say. Consistency is key. Push, push. This life is not easy, but then we'll keep hustling. Good hustle, low, and it will definitely pay off for us one day. Amadine Uyi, Plus TV Africa.